So now when you see that cursor is not blinking on the bottom left side of the terminal window, now your SAP server has already started. There is one more command that we have added to this tutorial or this step guide is this one. So if I copy and paste it to the terminal, press enter, I want to make sure that all the processes that are mentioned right here, here I'll, if I highlight all these four processes that you are looking for, okay? so. And you, you want to check if all the processes mentioned inside are green, okay? So green one, green two, green three, green four. In case that you will find something yellow in your process list, it means that your hardware is a little bit slower and you need to wait for a few moments and then run the same, the same command again. Reason why we do that is because sometimes when we see that uh, people who are using this SAP system are on slower hardware and they started the SAP server and for whatever reason they are not still able to log in to the SAP logon via SAP GUI, that's actually the reason why. So only when you see that all the processes are green here, only then we can move on to the next step.